What's up guys, welcome to today's video. It's been a while since I've uploaded, but in the time that I haven't uploaded, I have gone to a few Walmarts and Targets, but out of all the Walmarts, I finally found the Stars and Stripes complete set. This truck was the hardest one to find. I just could not find it. Otherwise, yeah, here's what the card art looks like when you put them all together. It's like, I don't know what it's supposed to be, but you can obviously see the Stars and Stripes. Uh, it's been a while since I've had these ones together, the 2020 releases, or well, 2020 and 2021, but I found these in 2020. I think when I last had these set up, I think it looked better than these, but I don't know. I'll have to do a comparison, but here we go. First up, car number one. Also, before we do that, what I will say is the little hooks right here, it does kind of ruin the aesthetic because if you have it out on a table like this, you know, you see that. So what they should have done is they should have had the card artwork connected like this. Where you would do it like that, then it connects. But, yeah, it still looks fine though. But most likely when I have it, like, on the wall up here, it's probably not going to be like this. It's just going to be four and four. Kind of like this, ten car set where I put five on one and five on the other. But, yeah, first car up... When I first found the set in store, I had found a Ranchero, the 84 Vet, and the Muscle Speeder. Here's the, the Ranchero. I have two, but when I found it, this was the only one left only because of this. Really bad crease in the card, so no one wanted it. So really, this one was one of the last ones I had found because at first when I went to the Walmart, like I said, I found that Ranchero, that 84 Vet, and the Muscle Speeder. Then I ended up finding, I think, the... Then I found the Mustang and another one the same day. Then a few days later, I found the Challenger. Then I found the Firebird. Then most recently, the most... I think it was Saturday, I found the Ranchero. Pontiac GTO in the 56 truck at one Walmart. They had two full sets. But, well, actually, there was only one truck. But, yeah. But here's the Ranchero. It's got the steely wheels. Of course, the red, white, and blue. Blue Hot Wheels logo. It's white. Got the flags up there. Black bed cover, I think. Yeah. And then here's the base. And here's what the back looks like. So there's number one of eight. This one's probably my favorite of the set just because I've always liked the 67 GTO. It's a gray. You got red and white stripes across the back, the roof, a little bit on the hood. Then he turns into the blue with stars. You got Goodyear, the gold base, five spokes with the gold lip. Same thing. You got those stripes, 76, and the stripes, or the stars. Then you got Goodyear with GTO. This is definitely probably my favorite of the set. No doubt about it. That one was really cool. Number three, we got the, uh, what is it, the 71 Challenger? Yep. It's a nice blue. It's kind of, it's like a, like a dark, deep blue. It has red interior, and I think it's a, I don't remember what those are called. Let me know in the comments. But it's part of the interior and the grill and the headlights and the taillights. You got MC5 with gold, stars, you got stripes. Well, of course it has stars and stripes. It says Challenger, Dodge, and it has a plastic wing, I believe, because it said made in Indonesia. Yep. So it's still got a plastic wing. But it's really subtle since it's the same color as the body. Got chrome base. And yeah, that one's it's, that one's alright. This one, it's been a while since this one's been released. But, yeah, this is this is the one that I find everywhere. There's like 10 of them, along with the Muscle Speeder and the Mustang. I need to get a new one of these since mine has a little paint on the tire, not the rim. But here we go. This one's really light than what my... Uh, 90s releases are I don't they're in the boxes so I can't really look it's white red white and blue is the Corvette logo 76 
gold PR5s, 76 again, and the Hot Wheels logo. Black base, and the roof is part of the window. I think the casting has always had that. That was pretty cool. Next up is the 84 Firebird in this nice black. It's got the stars and stripes all over the hood. There's the Firebird logo. And of course, that's the T-top. I believe that's what that's called. If not, then correct me. And there's nothing on the back. A little plain back there. Then you got those stars and the stripes along the side again. Trans Am, Hot Wheels logo, red base, and uh, MC5 with the white lip. Next up, 2018 Ford Mustang GT. It's blue and it has a lot, a lot of patriotism on it. There's the red and white and the stars. Continue on the roof, continue on the trunk. Continue all over the side. There's the Hot Wheels logo in between the stars. Then you got PR5 with the white lip on the front. PR5 with the red lip on the back. To be honest, I actually like the mixed wheels. Normally I don't like mixed wheels and crazy liveries like these. But it's a set and it's, I mean, it's pretty cool. So I like it. Now, 56 Ford truck. Now, it's not one of my, it's definitely not my favorite of the set. I just don't like the wheels. I, I really don't like those wheels. But just imagine they don't have it. It's a cool, it's a cool truck. You see it's got the, the whole thing's red, so there's no need for other red on it. Got the blue and white. And there's the hood scoop, I believe that's what that is. And uh, the interior is part of the bed, as well as the grill. Then it has black base and the chrome aero discs, which I've already said I do not like. And then, last but not least, you got the muscle speeder. I Every single time I see these wheels, I like them, but I, I ne don't know the name of them. Like, I really don't remember the name of them. I need to know the names of these. But it's red... It has the stars with the blue on it. Hot Wheels logo in between them. Get the white. And once again, the car is red, so there's no need for red on it. Black base. Get chrome around the black. And then, which is part of the interior and the engine that you can see. It's pretty cool. If you've never seen the other one, it's called the Project Speeder, which is just this, but has unfinished fenders. Otherwise... This set, if I had to say this set, like rate it 1 to 10, I would say, in my opinion, I'd say it's an 8. It's a cool set. There's just a few things I don't like about it, and that's in my opinion. To some other people, I'm sure this is a 10 out of 10 or a 9 out of 10. Some people, it's probably a 0 out of 10. Probably because they're like, where's the JDM? But it's an American set. But like I said, really the thing I don't like the most about it is the wheels on this truck. But otherwise, that is it for today's video. Comment down below if you want to what your favorite car was. And I will see you guys in my next video.